Hey y'all, it's uh, Sunday evening, so that's uh, time for me to do my end of the week wrap up on what um, I did this week. So, I added my 2,000 words to May and Catherine's um, number 9 for Crimson Rose, and I have about two scenes left that I'm going to work on hopefully maybe this week to finish that up. If not, it'll be early next week, and I don't really plan on publishing it to August sometime anyways, so that's cool. Um... I don't know if I'll make my 20,000 words, but we'll have to see. And um, if not, it'll be close to my 17,000, which some of the other uh, earlier ones I reached. That's what I got for those. So um, After that, I got to uh, make the cover, and I'll be talking to the cover artist with that uh, soon. And then I'm going to start uh, probably my last story for the year, because I'm planning on doing a longer one. And then that'll, that'll hopefully reach my uh, 100,000 word goal that I wanted. Um, I lowered that last week because I don't think I'm going to make 200,000. The year is almost half over, or it is half over, so. But it's okay. Um, so I'll probably hopefully have one more story published for the year. Um, I did uh, publish uh, Jenny and Dana's first one for Fayville last week. And I have the paperback done, and I just got to throw together the hardback, and that'll be taken care of, and I don't have to worry about it. Um, as usual, I didn't really make much on my books. Uh, you know, things are going kind of poorly right now with the way the world is, but, um, you know, it's an extra uh, 10 to 12 bucks, so it's better than I did last month. <laughs> um, so things are progressing. Um growing my backlist a little bit more and I can't believe actually uh, Alexandra's and Christie's first book is now six years old so I can't believe I've been doing this for six years <sighs> it's not something I actually thought I would still be doing uh, this long but it's you know it's a little side business a little bit of extra money so and moving on from there um, I just finished my deliveries for the week and I made my typical about 300 bucks. Actually, I made a little bit more this week, which was nice. So I got a bonus. Um, Amazon Prime Day and Grubhub signed up uh, for uh, um, Tuesday and Wednesday. So I made a little bit extra on uh, Wednesday for Grubhub. And now Amazon also has that um, free delivery for a year if you're a Prime member. Um, if you're and then using Grubhub. So I've gotten a little bit uh, better orders over there. So that's nice. And uh, I plan on doing that again this week, as usual. You know, my Wednesday through Sunday stuff. So, yeah, that's cool. And hopefully I will probably make my normal three, three, 300 or a little more. And uh, moving on from that, um, tomorrow I will have my uh, SH... SCHD uh, stock bought, which I threw a hundred bucks in, which is my normal. I do a hundred hours a week, and that should get me to about a hundred hours a year for dividends. So that'd be nice. So that's an extra hundred bucks that I don't have to uh, go out and make myself. And the market did kind of turn around on Friday, so woo, it went up, yay. Um, I did change my uh, my portfolio around a little bit. I did sell my stock in uh, VOO. And I took that money and I bought uh, the extra shares of VTI that I had. So, because I realized I didn't really want both of those in my in the portfolio I have. Plus, that I also have VU over in my IRA because um, uh, what the heck is that called? Um, Acorns. Yes, that's what it is. Acorns. Um, that's what they use for over there as the uh, main ETF is a VOO. So. Um, I won't be buying any more VTI for a while because I have about uh, 600 hours or three shares into it right now. So I want to catch my other ones up. And then um, later in the week, I will be buying uh, some of my um, other two that I'm missing, which is like KeyBank and a local company, which is Paychex. They do like um, accounting for uh, big businesses. So... I want to even those out to the three hundred dollars, and then whatever shares, because Key, Key will probably get me about two or three shares each, um, at a hundred bucks, because Key's not very expensive. So, yep, that's coming along. So hopefully, uh, 
I will have that done um, by the end of the year, or by the end of the month, and I will be moving on just to uh, even out my uh, my in, uh, income that I'm going to invest on those. So at this point, I have about $3,100 invested, and my dividends are growing. So yay! And then I got about a hundred or a thousand over in acorns. So cool. Um, Tomorrow will also be baking day as usual, so we're doing chocolate chip this week. And uh, other than that, I'm going to post this video and go do my yoga. Um, and then tomorrow and Friday is my walk day, which I go off for about 20 minutes. And then Wednesday is going to be yoga again. And beyond that, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do this week. Probably do some gaming um, and reading, uh, as usual. And so that's that's about it. Uh, you know, same old, same old, I guess. So if you made it this far and you listened to me ramble, <laughs> um, let me know how things are going with you, you know, with your writing or just in life in general. Or, you know, things are kind of tough right now. So, you know, sometimes you just need to uh, share, I guess. And that's basically what I do with these videos. Uh, so... And then that's it for now. Um, hopefully the two free advertisements that I'm going to do for my uh, Jenny and uh, Dana's book will get me a little more sales, but we'll see. So that's it. I'm going to call it, and I will see you next Sunday.